So I'm Kathy Stack. Uh, I am a career civil servant. I've worked in the federal government since 1978. Uh, most of that time has been at the Office of Management and Budget. I came over in 1982 uh, and have spent all but six years there since. Um, in between, I was at the Department of Education getting a bit of a reality check on what it's like to work in a federal agency. Uh, I also took three years off and had my kids and did the whole mommy thing, like full time. And glad I did that, but also happy to get back to the office. Um, I'm a division director. Uh, I'm on the budget side of OMB, and I have about 30 people who work for me. Uh, and I oversee three branches. One uh, oversees the education department policies. Uh, another is the labor department and the Corporation for National S and Community Service. And the third is the income maintenance branch, which handles a hodgepodge of low income programs, uh, Social Security Administration, the Food and Nutrition Service, and the uh, Administration for Children and Families. It's, you know, it's a lever that you can use to shut down bad things, and uh, a lot of people in OMB, that's primary, primarily their job to make sure that bad things don't happen. Um, there are also levers that allow you to say to an agency who wants to try something, you see creative people out in the agencies who, who desperately <laughs> want to try something different, um, you know, bring in a new partner, and we can sometimes say to them, you know, what you're proposing won't quite work, but if you do it this way, we can find you support. We can find you support someplace in the White House. There's a, a domestic policy advisor who's trying to get something done, and it seems like you might have a good platform for that. Uh, or we can see another program that um, elsewhere in government that's already gotten the green light to do something, and if they partnered with this agency that's trying to do something similar, they'd have a much more dramatic impact. Um, so. The, you know, the levers are often levers of no, but because we have that power, we also can be the levers of yes and point people in a slightly different direction. Um, you know, again, it's building trust. You, we build trust with the people in the agencies, but we also build trust with the political officials. And um, there are policy folks who come in from administration to administration who have great ideas, but they have no idea how government works. And I guess I'm in a position where um, both having been at OMB and seen a lot, but also worked at an agency, I sort of understand the culture and I understand the tools. And knowing how to translate what are the big ideas, the visionary ideas that, that political officials have, and how do we a, break through the psychology of the agencies who, who don't think that they're allowed to do that sort of thing. And then what are the specific tools, whether it's how you do procurements or how you write a grant solicitation uh, or how you craft regulation that allow you to actually translate all of that into action.